Well, certainly one of the more anticipated new production cars at this year's North American International Auto Show is behind me. The 2016 Chevrolet Volt is the follow-up to the first generation Volt, which is very ambitious, but never sold in the quantity that Chevy was hoping. Now we think this one will go a lot further towards fixing the issues that people might have had with the first generation Volt. That is, namely, it looks a lot better, more conventional. The profile has been way cleaned up, uh, no longer the big black uh, uh, cladding around the windows. The rear is a uh, sporty, uh, tightened up look and, and is not as visually as heavy as the previous Volt. And uh, of course, under the skin is where most of the changes take place, and we're thankful for that. Things like a larger battery with the new uh, battery chemistry, we're getting more power out of that pack, which is providing a longer range. Chevy says to expect up to 50 miles per gallon or up to 50 miles of range, I should say, on a fully charged battery before the new 1.5 liter Ecotec engine kicks in, which is supposed to be more refined, quieter, smoother, and more efficient when it's running on gasoline to power the uh, electric um, motors. So the motors themselves have been redesigned. Really no part of this Volt is carryover from the first generation, and uh, Chevy's promising just much improved uh, noise vibration harshness, uh, characteristics as well as performance. Uh, 0 to 60 is improved and the 0 to 30 was a special target uh, to really make it feel a lot more uh, sprightly off the line. Chevy took feedback from the current Volt owners and really cleaned up the styling at the rear, reduced the visual weight of it, got rid of the uh, kind of odd glass wrap over rear hatch, made a lot more conventional looking car out of it but of course very fresh and uh, they've also done a few things like made it easier to store the charging cord um, on the side of the trunk as opposed to under the trunk floor so you could still load things in your trunk and be able to get access to that. They've also improved uh, the interior dramatically with new materials. They got rid of the uh, capacitive touch buttons on the center stack that were also a hassle and uh, really they've done their best to listen to Volt owners and provide what they want in this new car while still improving it uh, in every component from the engine to the uh, battery uh, to the transmission. It's all been touched and refined for up to 50 miles electric range in the 2016 Chevy Volt.